good. It's your girl Black Daddy Creative Southern Bell. Um, I haven't did an update in a long time. So I'm gonna grace the camera and everyone with my presence. <laughs> But um, just in case anyone doesn't know who I am, I am Black Daddy, the creator, the, um, film, the filmographer, the editor, the director of Southern Bill's web series, LGBT, based on the LGBT community, with action, drama, thriller, suspense. But um, I wanted to give y'all a few updates on what's going on with Southern Bell's. And I want to answer a few questions that I've seen under my comments under certain episodes. Number one, the biggest thing that our fans and our supporters keep asking us is when we're gonna drop, when we're gonna drop, when we're gonna drop, when we're gonna drop, when we're gonna drop this episode. Okay, I love it. Trust and believe it. I love you guys. But this takes time. It takes time. And it takes more time when you have some of your cast members based in North Carolina, which is me. You know, I'm the main key because I'm the one that records. I want, I'm the one that writes everything, giving these characters, these, you know, these actings to do, these certain things, scenarios to do. I have to figure out locations. I have to um, base everything around everyone's schedule. And then I also have cast members in New York, you know, and by them being in New York and me being down south, it, you know, it kind of, it's kind of hectic sometimes. So bottom line is, I don't want to stay on this subject too long, bottom line is that we have lives just like you do. We, we go to work, we go to school, we have children, you know, we have other family members that we have to take care of, we have other things as well, just as much as this production. I'm not saying that it's not as important as this production, but family is first. That's just bottom line. I love my production, but family is first. So we have to meet once a month, and not this episode out. That's what we do. And that's why we give you an hour and a half of nothing but thrill, suspense, action, talking, and stuff like that that comes with the series, and with the episode. We do that because we know we cannot film as of right now for season one every week or every two weeks. We only can film once a month. And then when we film once a month, we knock that whole episode out. You know, because that's when we can actually be together and, and do what we do as a production, as a team. So that's number one. So, you know, that's our gift to you since we can't do it once a week or every two weeks. That we at least make our episodes longer so you can enjoy and kind of anticipate for next month's episode. Okay? And it's kind of smart. From from a from a marketing promotion side, it's kind of smart. Okay, the next, um, the next uh, update in question and that I want to you know address as well because it, it is a question and it's an update. So the question is why do some scenes be so dark? We have to get a certain lighting and I'm not even front some lighting doesn't work at all. It doesn't work at all. So we have to do what we do. You know we kind of have to improvise and all the extra stuff that comes with learning. Okay. Now me myself um, I'm going to school at Full Sail. I'm going to school at Full Sail. This is my first year, and I'm only in for a couple of months. I want to say like a good eight months that I've been dealing with Full Sail. And I'm actually learning about lighting. So please take time with me. I'm doing the best as I can. I'm learning. It's a learning process. This filming thing is not easy. And I'll be the first to say that. It is not easy. So I give all the utmost respect to everyone that's taking their own time and filming their own series, their own independent movies, their videos, whatever you are doing behind the camera and you have to edit it, I give you props because I know how it feels, you know, and it's hard. So you, it's a learning process. It's not that we just want to put this, these projects out and or make it look like this, make it look like that. It's that we have to do this because we learn from it. That's just the bottom line. So I'm going to make that short as well. But that's why the lighting is, you know, it's crazy sometimes. Because I know in two episodes the lighting is, and I will be the first to admit that. But it's still good. We still got bad views. A lot of people still respect what we do as a production, period. So um, I, my apologies. I'm sorry for it. But 
I'm learning. Give me respect. I'm learning. Okay. Now, in Southern Bells, there are three camera ladies. That's myself, Timo, there's Team Rail, and then there's Team Phoenix. We are the three that film everything. You know, so if me and, um, if, if Mo and Phoenix need to do a, a certain scene, Team Rail gonna take the camera and do what she do. If Rail and Phoenix does a scene, Team Mo got to do it. You know, so it, so we flip flop. We flip flop. We all learning, so give us credit when credit is due. You know, we only a little small production, and we, we, we making it work. I think we doing a damn good job for us to be three ladies that works this camera, you know. And by me going to school and my girl doing this and that and the family stuff going on, I got to edit all that. So, yes, it's a lot. It's a lot. And we still learning, so please bear with us. We will only get better with time. So I appreciate that. Yeah, for our new characters, we have uh, Monica, who's played by Ashley. We have Asia, who plays by Drea. We have Mace, who plays by Flo. We have Rona, who plays by Mercedes. Um, we have Mona, who plays by Candy. And we have all these new characters. Matter of fact, six. We have six new characters for the show. And these characters are the main key, the main focus of why this character acts this way. That character act this way. So you will better understand each character as the story unfolds. So stay tuned for those new characters. They will be showing in episode six. You already had, you know, one, you know, new character who came to play, which was Lacey. And Lacey, that's a loose cannon. As you can see, she came, she saw, she did what she did, she walked the fuck out. That's what she did. But um, these characters... Like I said, they are the main key of why other characters act the way they act. So, um, I want to say thank you to my new cast members. You know, trust me, we about to get it popping. But, um, I also want to say, again, thank you to the LGBT community. Thank you to the straight community as well. Because, I'm telling you, we have people across the world watching Southern Bells. We have people across the world. You know, we have a soldier from Afghanistan who's watching. And it's an honor to have a soldier from Afghanistan take out his time to watch our show while serving the country. So that's a blessing. That's a blessing. And thank you. Thank you so much for believing in Southern Bells. We also have a couple of fans out there in England, Ukraine, and Britain. Um, we have talked to a couple of these fans, and they are the bomb. They are the bomb. They are the bomb. So we appreciate it. We have fans everywhere, and we want to continue to have fans everywhere. Because without you guys, we are nothing. Southern Bell couldn't have the platform that they have. Because y'all share it. Y'all like it. Y'all leave comments. Y'all let us know what we're doing wrong. Like, y'all let us know everything. And trust and believe, I take everything that you say. And I take it to heart, and I put it on this laptop, and I get it going and giving you a good product. Other creators and other editors and, and directors out there that really want to work with Southern Bell or characters of Southern Bell or from Southern Bell, please feel free to contact me at southernbellseries at gmail.com. Again, that is southernbellseries at gmail.com. And if you really need to personally talk to me, please hit me up at blackdahlia82 at gmail.com. Okay, um, that's for business, networking, connections, and everything. You can also follow us on YouTube at Southern Bells Web Series. You can also follow the Southern Bells on Instagram on Southern Bells Series as well. You can also go to our fan page on Facebook, which is Southern Bells Web Series. So trust, anytime you put in Southern Bells Web Series, everything is going to pop up. If you need to personally talk to me, you can DM me in my Instagram. You can hit me up on my Snapchat, and we also have a Snapchat called Black Dahlia 33, K2 Southern Bells Web Series. So follow us on Snapchat. Keep updates with us. Let us know what's going on. Let us know your views from the production that we created for you guys. And another thing that I want to put out there as well, we are looking for more prompts. We're looking to raise money for the Southern Bell so we can bring out a better quality production for you guys. So please feel free to donate Anything from a dollar to whatever you want to donate. Any donation is good for us. 
you can go donate at GoFundMe slash Southern Bells Web Series. So please, the links will be at the bottom. Every all the all the information that you need from us guys will be up under this video. I also want to um, say thank you to everyone that's been working with me from the past to now to the present. And I am utmost grateful for all my new people and all the past people that I met during this journey. Without my past and my presence that's here, we wouldn't have a good production. I wouldn't be who I am. I wouldn't be the creator that I am. So I love you guys. Thank you for everything that you are doing for Southern Bells and for me and my cast members as well. I want to say thank you guys for tuning in. It's your girl Black Dahlia, the creator of Southern Bell, Team Mo. Shout out to my cast members. I love you guys. Always shooting out there in New York. Mwah, mwah, mwah. My fans and my supporters, we are nothing without you. Please continue to support us for what we do. Thank you. Love you guys. God bless. Manifest. It's your girl Black.